Are you ready to film this week's episode? Yep. Okay. Who's here? We're not expecting anyone. Hi, and welcome to Crafts by Two. I'm George. And I'm Ken. And we'd like to introduce you to our very special guest, the Cricut Explorer One. A new Cricut machine at a lower retail price of $199. It makes it even more affordable. And right now, all we know is it's a box that says Cricut Explorer One, and we're going to open it up right now. I only got a glimpse of the delivery man, and he looked a lot like a sheesh. So let's open it. I can't wait to see. I have the blade. <laughs> they don't trust me since the Between Crafts Slurpee episode. No, it was even before that. <gasps> Ooh. Now, I have to say, Unlike other Cricut boxes we get, this one has no packing paper. Introducing... Uh, Air pressure. <laughs> uh, uh, the Cricut Explore One. Ooh, it's a nice box. Design set. Go. So it looks a lot like the regular Cricut Explore and the Cricut Explore Air from the outside. Let's open it and see what's different. You get a mat. You always get a mat. I'm gonna set that down in the floor. And your Start Here packet, which we'll open up in just a minute. And then the machine. Put those back over the box. But also in the box were your power supply and a USB cable. tape stuck to it. The new Cricut Explore 1. It comes in gray and it's the same dimensions as the Cricut Explore and the Cricut Explore Air. It even has an access port on the side someplace, there it is, for your Bluetooth adapter. Let's take off the protective tape that holds it closed during shipping and open it. Ooh. So there's also the styrofoam for shipping. It's got the same trays for your tools and accessories and blades. But look at this. The smart cut system only has one port. There's no accessory port. But you can just pop this right off. And then take your blade out. Wow. So let's do a side-by-side -side comparison between a Cricut Explorer and a Cricut Explorer Air and a Cricut Explorer 1. Here we have a column each for the Explorer 1 the original Explorer, and the Explore Air. The first difference is the Explore 1 has one clamp head. This is a multifunction clamp head that can cut, score, and write. The Cricut Explore and the Explore Air have two clamp heads, one dedicated to cut and the other dedicated to score and write. The Cricut Explore Air is the only machine that has Bluetooth built in, 
With the Explore One and the original Explore, you can purchase a Bluetooth adapter to add Bluetooth to your device. The Explore One doesn't come with any pens or markers, but the original Explore and the Explore Air both come with a Cricut pen. For the Explore One, the accessory adapter is a separate purchase. The Explore and the Explore Air come with the accessory adapter. The original Cricut Explore and the Explore Air both come with a nifty carrying bag, but the Explore One doesn't. So the biggest difference comes down to price. On Cricut's site, we've seen the Cricut Explore One listed for $199.99. The original Cricut Explore is listed for $229.99, and the Cricut Explore Air is $249.99. So the Cricut Explorer 1 is a great entry-level device. So now that we compared the machines, let's look at the starter packet to see what it comes with. It says start here on the front. Oops, ripped it. <laughs> so it comes with some guides, your computer guide. Oops the support information for 18777 cricket in case you have any problems you should keep that number handy the computer setup that'll show you how to hook it up to your PC or Mac and a guide to learn more what's that show it shows you how to learn more Ken <laughs> tells you about everything that came in the box and the tools that you can get to it and how to replace blades and it has white on the back. <laughs> and you can get free online craft classes from Creative Bug video classes and then your warranty. Yay warranty! And vinyl instructions. So this tells you how to place the vinyl onto the mat and follow the on-screen instructions for creating and cutting your images. Wow, I wonder what the first project will be. And they give you a nice piece of gray vinyl to go along with the color of your new Cricut Explore 1. This Ken and I both jumped to make sure it doesn't <laughs> slide off. So that was your starter pack. That's a great deal for the price point. So that's what you get with the new Cricut Explorer 1. In our next video, we're going to show you how to set it up on your PC or Mac and do your first project with it. So make sure you stay tuned and watch that video too. So let's summarize one last time the differences between the Cricut Explorer 1 and the Cricut Explorer Explorer Air. The Cricut Explorer 1 doesn't come with a carrying bag like the Cricut Explorer or Explorer Air came with. It also comes with only one clamp instead of two, one for a blade and one for an accessory. But this clamp is multifunction. You can use it with your blade housing, your score tool, or even the forthcoming pen adapter and pens, like this. Because the Cricut Explore 1 only has the one accessory arm, you have to swap out the blade if you want to use the pen for writing or the stylus for scoring. The accessory adapter fits right in your handy little storage tray and it's a little plastic insert. So for example if I was using the scoring tool I would just slide that on until the arrows disappeared in the front, open up the accessory arm, remove the blade, and insert the scoring tool and snap it closed. Design Space will prompt you for when to switch the tool. For example, if it wants to be scoring or if it wants to be writing. So pay attention to your prompts in Design Space. It's the same for the pen. Using a Cricut pen, make sure that you have the arrow in the front and slide on the accessory arm, then place it in and lock it. It doesn't have built-in Bluetooth, 
like the Cricut Explorer Air, but it has an accessory port like the original Explorer, so you can buy a Bluetooth adapter and use it that way. Once you have your Bluetooth adapter, all you need to do is slide it into the side port on your Explorer 1. It's just like the original Explorer. Once you have it slid in, you'll have Bluetooth capability. We'll have a link to our video for setting up the Bluetooth adapter with the original Explorer, and it's going to be pretty much the same thing. Yep, the machine is pretty much the same, except for the one clamp instead of two. It's about the same weight, a little bit lighter, but it's the same sturdy build as all the other Cricut machines. And it's the same size. You'll be able to cut exactly the same materials as you would across all the Explorer line. So 12 by 12, 12 by 24. You can cut it all. Can I cut wood? Uh, yeah. Can I cut leather? Yeah. Can I cut felt? Yes. As long as it's all the right size and thickness and you use your material settings. Because even this Cricut Explorer has a great dial on it. You just dial in your settings. And you can use custom and do your other settings in design space. Easy peasy. If you found this video informative or funny, give us a thumbs up. It lets YouTube know that you like this video and it'll help them find viewers that might like us too. We also appreciate your questions and comments. If you have questions, we'll do what we can to help out. But if you're looking for support with your Cricut Explore 1 or any of the Cricut Explore line, your best bet is to contact Cricut Support directly. In your Start Here packet, there is that card right in front with the contact information. And they're great people. They love to make sure that you're happy and your machine's working well in case you should have any trouble. We know from our experience with the Cricut Explore family that it unleashes a whole world of creativity and options for you with your crafting. So you want to check us out and subscribe to our videos so that way you can see all the great projects we're making with our Cricut Explore, Cricut Explore Air, and now the Cricut Explore 1. So until next Tuesday, or probably sooner, because I want to get it to cut for the first time. I want to see the new project. We'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. And it had a sneak, and it had a sneaking suspicion. I have to dis. <laughs> but he had a remarkable relent. <laughs> I only got a glimpse of the. Early on, I think you said the Cricket Explorer, Explorer Air. Yeah. Like I, you said the Cricket Explorer, and then you said. Give us a thumbs up. That helps Facebook let other viewers know they might like us too. YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> we know from our experience with the Cricket Explorer family, it unleaks. 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 <laughs> it has no leaks in it. <laughs>